You may have noticed as you're clicking around and adjusting the body paragraphs, when you run into this letter style, I think, oh great, you click here, you apply the letter style, and everything works fine. But you notice this first sentence looks all messed up. The reason for that is the justification of these three letters, or sorry, words by themselves with a forced line break don't exactly look right. What you can do in InDesign is individually select items, click in here, and instead of justified with text, you can come and just left justify. Now, as you see, that messed everything up again, crud. So if you click back into this paragraph here, you right click onto the letter style and you hit apply letter style, you go back and forth. What's happening? Well, it's this forced line break here. That is the problem. Let me zoom in. And you can see this little sideways L. That little sideways L is meant to be a non-breaking uh, line. It's uh, one of those odd characters I warned you about. And sure enough, it's causing problems. So what we're going to do is go to the next line, hit delete, hit enter, and this creates a new paragraph line. Now, this looks a little bit more like a letter, and we can set the left adjust to however we want it. So this breaks out the letter here from the text. Also, when you have this sort of thing, I would recommend clicking here and adding just a carriage return. You can do a lot of work and add more letter uh, styles and headers and all sorts of stuff, but at that point, you might be making more work for yourself than not, because the whole goal is not to do as much work as possible. So this is something that's left up to you as a student to decide, do I make another style just for the introduction of the letter, or do I just tweak it out because there are only a few letters in the book? That's your call. But as we march along, you can see the yours, etc. And now I have the rest of the body paragraph to do by clicking here, coming to the end of the file, holding shift click, I can apply the body paragraph. And now if I zoom out just a bit, scroll up, you can see all the body in this chapter 61 looks fine. The letter looks pretty decent and the rest of the body looks decent here. So there are definitely some gotchas on the alignment and everything of just, hey, I'll do a body paragraph or a letter style paragraph style and that'll fix all my problems when in fact there are some other little things here. So hopefully that explains why you end up with some messed up text is simply because sometimes with those special characters that I warned you about in a previous lesson, they can cause some problems with your layout. I hope you found this video on InDesign helpful. I've got an entire instructional course on how to take your manuscript and fix it up, run it through InDesign, and generate a professional PDF. Check out the link below in the description, click into it, and learn all about InDesign and learn everything you need to generate that professional print-ready PDF. My name is Aaron Linsdow. I'm a Polar Explorer and professional InDesign instructor. Thank you very much for watching. Please like and comment on the video. And if you found this helpful, subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.